Welcome to MoCo video. My name is Stephanie Palomino and today we talk about health apps. We have a very interesting guest, Felix Brandt from Cardio Secure. So uh, tell me a little bit more about the product. Um, it is a heart check on a profound clinical basis. Um, whenever, wherever, when people feel symptoms, to get an idea whether there are any pathological changes or not and get a feedback what to do. So how your like average user looks like, who is that is the person? Our target user is someone who has heart symptoms, but must not necessarily be a patient. Of course, we also have heart attack patients and uh, we want to help people when they feel symptoms and they're unsure about their situation, whether there is need for seeing a doctor in that moment or not. So for your product, do you see any kind of like use case for the iWatch? I think one really has to understand that we are not in the field of gadget ECGs. Um, if you want to have a fundamental clinical reading uh, like Cardio Secure has, um, the iWatch is not of an additional uh, benefit. So how is your marketing strategy? How the end users will know about you? Yeah. So we, we drive a, a fairly strong online strategy, so online marketing strategy. Um, we uh, create a lot of content. We um, create uh, freemium uh, uh, aspects in our app and also web-based. And uh, so this is uh, very critical to create content which is meaningful to people and which addresses the issues. On the way developing the product, what were the biggest challenge? We started off with a standalone solution. So before the tablet and smartphone era, uh, we were linked to hardware components um, like a Nokia display, for instance, okay. uh, which would be cancelled from one year to another and we would have to redesign our entire hardware, which was a quite impossible situation. So for us it was essential to switch to smartphones and tablets. So from your experience from making apps, is there any mistake you did we could learn from? One has to talk to users, yeah, the designated users. One has to understand really what they are up for, um, the depth of complexity of such an app, what is um, manageable for users, what is not. I think uh, drawing these um, critical distinctions is very, very important. Thank you so much for having you here, Felix. Thank you all for listening today. Subscribe us on YouTube and see us soon.